After a 16-hour long debate, the Texas House of Representatives passed HB 150, which is the House Redistricting Proposed Map. The biggest changes in comparison to the last update I provided affects the Panhandle and South Plains region of Texas. In the last version, freshman legislators Charles Perry, a Republican from Lubbock, and Jim Landtroop, a Republican from Plainview, were paired to run against one another. However, after an amendment proposed by John Smithy, a Republican of Amarillo, Perry and Landtroop will now maintain separate districts. Perry would stay in District 83, but Landtroop would run in District 88, an area represented by Warren Chisholm for more than two decades. Landtroop's existing House District 85 would be phased out. The biggest concern for this change is that the original proposal would have created a district that ran from New Mexico to Oklahoma, leaving Terry, Lynn, Garza, Kent, and Stonewall counties susceptible to a representative from as far east as Wise or Cook counties. This adopted map would still leave 12 Republicans paired against one another and two Democrats paired against one another. As a reminder, the new House districts would have approximately 167,000 people, up from 140,000 people for the last 10 years. This increase is a result of the 2010 census that showed Texas has grown by 4.3 million people.